All right, ladies and gentlemen, guess what? We're jumping right the fuck back into this shit. Yes, that's right. This is a new gameplay session for me of Dying Light 2. Last time around, we were trying to do this timed parkour session. It did not go well at all. It kept failing for various buggy piece of shit reasons. So let's see if I can do it now on the... Usually when I have a lot of fails and something like this, if I come back to it at a future date, I just end up beating it like right away. So let's see if I can actually just beat this on the first shot now and have no issues. Go. All right, jump. He grabbed it, and now jump. No, he didn't. I think I was out of stamina, and I needed to wait to rejuvenate my stamina. A Saudi oil prince tipped me a dollar fifty, saying, "Phil, do you not answer me yesterday? Are you willing to allow me to fly your family to my Dubai mansion? Will you unclog my toilet and sink?" In front of an audience of priests. I'll give you five oil drums and 12 bars of gold. Who do I look like? Vince McMahon running pay-per-views in Saudi Arabia? <laughs> the answer I have for you is simple. Straightforward. Clear. Concise. No! I'm not going over. Oh, Ryu. Hello, Ryu. How you doing? No, I'm not going over there. That's cool that Ryu is right there next to me. Okay. Let's try again. I think I, I screwed this up. I wasn't looking at my stamina. So I'll take the blame for that one. I should have looked at my stamina bar to see how much I had left, and I did not. All right. Let's try again. The music's great. Too bad the segment sucks. The music's great. Alright, so now I gotta wait. Gotta wait for this to come by. Hold on. I wanna make sure it the... Yes. The one thing about these neck phones, there's a built-in microphone. I've never tested it, but if you don't mute it, you get feedback sometimes. Um in the actual neck phones, an echo. It's very annoying, so. Okay. Okay, I almost ran out of stamina, but I made it. Now here's the tricky come jump. On, come on, come on. This one you have to climb Last here, up. then up to another Go one. Ahead. And then onto the platform. And this is the one I haven't made yet. I haven't been able to do this yet. Let's see what happens. Okay. Ready? Jump. Make it, make it, make it. Okay, I made it. Now what do I do? Ladder. Okay. Finally. I think I'm going to do it this time. Now, uh, oh, God, there's another one? There's another one? I don't even know how to do this. I have to go all the way to the left, perhaps? I, I don't know. Oh, there it is. Okay. Oh, my God. Jesus, fuck, how high is this? Plant the bomb. Jesus, get out of here now. Zipline, holy shit. All right, we did it. Thank God we did it. Oh, broke? Oh, fuck. It broke. Ew, now he's in toxic water. Well, that fucking worked, finally. What's funny is that was a giant propeller with, like, a giant plane engine, didn't it? It was, like, a giant plane propeller up there. Jeez. Hello? Hey, Alberto? 
I'm coming. I guess they came and attacked him. Yeah. You sons of bitches. What have you done to him? Ew, their head just pop off. My boy. Yuck. A wristwatch. There's a severed head. Fuck. A <laughs> severed head just sitting there. Sunday shoes. <clears throat> no. That's wow. what I call. He's gonna die, huh? And boom. <laughs> I got my boom. <laughs> you, you, you got them pretty good. Huh? But we, we got them good. Without you, the windmill would still be standing. Almost like uh, the fireworks in 90... Uh, I'm going to close my blinds. 90, hold on. Uh, uh, even... Ah, uh, man. I'm old. And you'll just keep getting older. Quit the bullshit, Aiden. Oh, okay. I'm not that adult. Thanks for helping me. <laughs> I know what they think of me. Of course I know. Help everyone. We pulled this off thanks to Vincenzo. Okay. The subtitles froze. <laughs> Look, they didn't move. Thanks to you, Alberto. Yeah. No. Thanks to Vincenzo. Okay. Gary Oak says, I thought this was the end of the game. We're not even in the main game yet. I'm serious. Of me. <laughs> but now that we've done this, they won't laugh anymore. <clears throat> his his old man's huh? not a cook or a or a failure anymore. <laughs> Force the peacekeepers to withdraw. Say it was him. Promise me. <clears throat> All right. Okay. Oh, and tell him. Tell him that... That's okay. I'll tell him. That I'm proud. Never told him that. Well, you're a shit dad then. You're a shithead. My dad told I me he was proud of me all the time. And now he's dead. I'll tell him for you. Well, remember, never speak ill of the dead. Speak ill of them right before they die, so that way you're not speaking ill of the dead. <laughs> there you go. <clears throat> All right, I got it in. I got the last insult in. Very good. Gun says eventually he wants to get either a PS5 or Xbox Series X, and he's going to try to get neck phones too. I like them. I've actually seen these on sale on Amazon many times. I paid a hundred for them when they were new in the fall, but apparently they're going for like seventy-five now. I like them. A lot of people don't like them because they're looking for the full surround sound headphone experience, which you're not going to get with neck phones. But they're pretty damn good for what they are, in my opinion. Well, it's sad that he died. What's funny is some people are like, wait a minute. Phil, aren't you 12 or more hours into this game? How are these guys level 2? Because I'm not kidding you, this is still considered the fucking intro of the game. You think I'm joking, but that's the truth of the matter. Uh, that's how they designed this game. We have not hit the main city yet. We're working on it. We might do it today, but we haven't made it yet. Hey, hey, the nice fireworks show you put on. Now it's time to blow this popsicle. I can't. One thing I still have to take care of. You don't get it. There's no time to wait. We can make our way to the center now. Everyone's too busy to notice. I promised Alberto I'd tell his son something for him. Do you want to finish your business or play shepherd spreading the good word? <laughs> well, it's bad news, Hakan. Alberto is dead. I see. But the metro is empty. There might never be another chance like this. 
Are you sure? I'm going to do what I promised Alberta. I have to go find Vincenzo, Hakon. I promised. I already got the inhibitor in there, Jad Effects. We did it last time. Hurry. Remember Sarah and Yana. Find me at their place when you're done. If you're still alive. Okay. So now we gotta go find Alberto and tell him his dad died, but tell him that his dad was successful. Right? With the whole windmill deal and, and go from there. I guess we're supposed to feel really bad. I mean, it is sad the guy died, but... Again, when a game that's so slow-paced, it's hard to really care about anything. I don't think you can tiptoe across the zip lines, can you? Cool if you could, but I don't think so. Question mark, but oh, is that it? It's a convoy. Yeah, it's an unknown location. Oh, look, it's one of those radioactive zombies. We haven't actually run into one of those yet. Those were prominent in the first game. I think those are tougher zombies because they were supposed to be scientists fighting the infection, but basically they failed and got turned anyway. So I think they're some of the tougher enemies. What's up, Tyrone? How you doing, man? Eternal Amos has noticed in Skyrim to put you into a wide open world in 20 minutes, not 12 hours. Exactly. And the thing is, not that we're not in an open world, we are, but it took two and a half hours to even hit the, 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 the mini open world in this game. You know what I mean? Like, yeah, I'm sorry, but some games basically just, I hate to say it, they way over-exaggerate their importance. This is one of them. Where things like, oh, this is the only game you're going to be playing for like, like three months. So we can just take our sweet fucking time with the game. And have it be so padded and take so long to do anything. It's like, uh, not everyone has that experience, just so you know. People have, you know, time constraints. They, they want to get to the good parts of the game relatively quickly. <clears throat> Sell this stuff. He doesn't have any, uh, any weapons or anything, so just sell my junk. Shout out to Chumbaget, who just became a channel supporter. Thank you for the membership, Chumbaget. Um... I'm curious because we are currently, guys, at the highest number of members we've ever had, 370. So I'm going to do, every time we get a member today, I'm going to refresh and see if we're hitting a new record. We very well might have just hit another new record. Let's take a look. We just did. We're at 371, guys. Get what you need. 371 and climbing. <clears throat> Thank you. Chat effects says... Well, actually, most people buy two games in a year. That's not true. Most gamers buy way more than that. But he says, most, game, most people buy only two games in a year, so it's true. It might take some people six months to, to experience the whole game. All right, now, I got to ask you this, JadFX. If you can only buy two games a year, is Dying Light 2 one of them? Or would you wait and buy Horizon to, uh, on Friday? You know, Horizon Forbidden West. Would you buy Elden Ring? Would you buy God of War? Would you buy... You know what I'm saying? This game, I don't think is anyone's choice for, oh, the exclusive game I'm buying this year. So why have them design it and treat it as such? See what I'm saying? What is this item? Military convoy. So possibly a weapon. Or, all right. Nothing too major. I guess we can go down there and check it out since we're here. And then we'll go to the story. Someone's hurt, or someone's trapped. Not too many zombies here, so that's good. Rations. Hard lockpick. You fucking piece of shit. It's certainly interesting playing Skyrim and this game at the same time and having the same exact lockpick thing in both games. Another one. Okay. So far, really nothing good at all. Uh, what am I missing? I looted everything. Fuck. Yeah. 
can't loot this, right? What didn't I loot? It still says it's a military convoy, but there's nothing else to loot. Right? <clears throat> I know there's another guy to save right there. Quest giver. But I don't see anything else to loot here. No, I don't know. I'm trying to drop. I don't even know what's going on. I guess I give up. I think the convoys are stupidly glitched or something. Because it's acting like there's still items to collect, even though I looted the tank and both trucks. And it still acts like there's a convoy here when there's nothing left to loot. So I give up. There's a big boy down there. See him? I thought I said there was a crate here, but now I don't see it. Can't get in here. Where's the quest giver? There's too many fucking icons on the screen. <laughs> Seriously, this is so annoying. I can't even make my bearings of what I'm looking at. There's a bunch of fucking zombies right there. There's a quest giver below me. There's another fucking question mark there. There's something there. It's a mess. dodged correctly and still fucking took damage. Well, I got a trophy. Chumba Loomba did a $16 tip, which is the biggest tip of the day. Thank you, Chumba Loomba. How noble of you, saving an enemy. You're not my enemy. But now we're on, what's the phrase, opposite sides of the barricades? <laughs> we're on the same side when the infected are involved. What are you doing here? I'm afraid that's top secret. So you're a spy. Should I warn the locals about you? All right, I'll tell you. It's a secret, just not a military secret. I was supposed to meet a girl here from the bazaar. I don't see anyone here. It looks like she stood you up. <laughs> this wasn't a date. We wanted to leave the city, get beyond the walls. Yeah, it's not that easy. We would find a way. Why do you want to leave? Chloe's had enough of there being shortages of everything at the bazaar, especially water. But the bazaar has water now. Chloe doesn't know that yet. She lives ah. outside the bazaar. You just go to her and check. I will. And can I ask you a favor to save time? I'll go to Chloe's place. Can you go to her friend Liz's? Chloe's always over there. She lives at 25 Wuthering Mews, third floor, above the old vegetarian restaurant. It's near the clinic. Why is he have an accent, by do. the way? Thanks. <laughs> Let me know over the radio when you get there. Oh, I see. I'm being told that the military convoys reset because they have infinite amounts of loot. So you loot it now, and then you're going to go back to it later, and you're going to get loot again. You see? That's why it, uh... It, didn't, it doesn't go away. The symbol, it's not like there's loot you didn't get. It's that the loot will respawn. Well, that's kind of silly. There's a container right there. How do I get to it? Right? How the fuck do I get to that container unless... Unless you can't and it's a reward only for completing this mission. Maybe it opens up after. Which I wouldn't put it past this game if that's the case. Like, maybe you do the mission and then this opens 
and you go inside and you get your reward. In fact, I'd probably say that's probably exactly what it is. Because there's no door on this thing, right? Oh, never mind. Apparently I have this. Okay, just ignore everything I just said. <laughs> ignore it completely. I'm just stupid, apparently. Here we go. Okay. What happened? I can't fucking see anything. <laughs> the light, I picked the lock and the lights went out. I couldn't see anything in here. What the hell was that? Fucking pitch black. You've received a new weapon. Ooh. All right, I guess we're out of here. Did I miss, uh... <clears throat> Did I miss the Super Chat? Did I miss Super Chat? I did. It looks like Babu Chan did a Super Chat. Thank you, Babu Chan. Let's get you on the leaderboard. Sorry that I missed your Super Chat. Thank you for letting me know, guys. <clears throat> and, uh... Is the game audio synced? I don't know. Is it synced, guys? Polish Pride is claiming that the audio is out of sync, but no one else has complained but Polish Pride. I'm not saying it's not happening. It's, it has happened before. Usually, when there's an audio desync, if I restart my PC, it fixes it. But I've recently restarted my PC within, like, the last week. So, I would be surprised if actually something was going on with that regard. Shark Teeth. What am I using right now? The Crude Machete? I think I should be using the Shark Teeth. Here we go, shark teeth. Here, let's see. Ready? That should be synced. What is it? The audio, the game audio synced. What can we test with the game audio? Here. Ready? Did the hits and the sound effects seem synced or not? Anyway, let's go up here. It's good. It's synced. Okay. Worth a test. And maybe just pull his pride. Maybe your stream is lagging a bit. That's happened. And if you refresh it, sometimes it fixes. So there's a question mark over here. And it's along the way to the mission anyway. So we might as well see what the question mark is. Down there. Let's get across the street. I definitely think the traversal help is better than the traps that they claim that they set. I honestly don't know what the traps would help. Um, because the traversal is really the problem, getting around the city. You don't need traps to stop the zombies if you can just go through the city easily. Okay, so this is this below me? A Forsaken Store night activity. Alright, never mind. Can't do that till the night anyway. I'm no PK fan. Something fuck will you You. Did you hear him? Yeah, baby. Yeah, baby. Oh, Jesus, fuck. All his limbs came off. <laughs> okay, then. Yeah, baby. Just chop all my limbs off. I'm very excited about this. It's fucked up. Sheesh. A raggedy chopper. These zip lines are useful. Alright, everyone seems to be saying that everything is synced, so I'm I'm pleased. I, I believe you guys. Oh shit. Stories over here. Uh, right here. Okay, we're going back to the bazaar. Okay. Wait, why is the door fucked up? Uh-oh. So it was Carl who betrayed them. How do you know? Wait, what? Oh, Carl was the, the previous leader. I hope Jack and that deals with these guys. This sucks. Yeah, these are the people you're around. siding with. All cleaned up. Oh my god, they killed them all? Yeah, because they're cowards. Told you before. Yo, they, caught, they killed everyone in the bazaar. Throw them in the dungeon? Unless you feel like banging them first. Wow. Look. It's Chubbs. They killed Chubbs? Looks like it. But only him, I think. We gotta tell Anderson. 
Yeah, but where is she? Should have been here ages ago. I'll look for her. What the heck? Pilgrim. <coughs> 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 I wonder if everyone here is dead. Well, this is a fucked up plot. Get Solid shoes. Why are they all coughing? Shit, what'd they do to you? Chums. I'll kill all those motherfuckers. <laughs> Baggy sweatpants. All right. You're free. I thought it was over, man. I can't believe Carl betrayed us. Yeah, the former leader. <laughs> At first I thought you gave us up. But Carl... If it wasn't for him, the peacekeepers wouldn't have attacked. But he fled right after the blast. There are more on the upper level. Okay, I'll go there. You run. What's up, Matthew? How you doing, man? <clears throat> so far, so good. Making progress. <laughs> Such very complex combat. Camo breaches. Might as well heal again. Okay. You're Aiden, right? The reports are true. You'd make a great peacekeeper. Must be on the second level. I don't know who's talking. I have no idea who's speaking because I killed them all. <clears throat> okay. What's up, D-Man Gaming? How you doing? Hey. Aiden. Ah, there they are. They were holed up. It's safe now. Thank you. Hey, Sophie. So where's Vincenzo? Aiden, watch out! What the shit? Hater's gonna pay me hella gold for you. Cut. Shit. <laughs> Guy wasn't even worth a golden shower. Get up, Aiden. Thanks, man. That makes us even. It's not over yet. Aiden! Aiden! Come on, oh. coward! <clears throat> More? Come down and fight! You better get out of here, Anderson. You're on bizarre turf. Well, tell Ader there's still time to call this off. Why would he do that? We're winning. You're stupider than I thought. Calm down and fight, and stop using your bizarre buddies as human shields. I don't know who, even who this is, right? I have Aiden, no idea. Supposed to be a boss. Should have killed you. What the fuck? Where am I? I'm stuck in the fucking wall. Are you shitting me? Couldn't fucking move. I'm 
come on, bullshit. Oh, she's fucked. She can't get up. Oh, man, that's brutal. Oh. Oh. Aiden. Damn. The that Aider's men are retreating. The plan worked. We took out their lights and the infected tore them to pieces. They don't stand a chance without them. Ader withdrew his men. They're in the metro tunnels. We're not getting to the center that way. Carl betrayed us. He's the one who went to the peacekeepers and warned them. Claimed he wow. to prevent bloodshed, but made things worse. But now, I run the bazaar. And I promise, we will defeat Ador. And I will take you to the central loop. Sophie runs the bazaar! For Sophie! So I'm being told from Anu Barakable. From Anu Barakable, they're, uh, they're saying, you know those, those voices we heard out of nowhere? They sound like disembodied voices of the PKs. Those were voice triggers. What was supposed to happen is when you walk to a certain area of the building, they trigger. But I had killed the guards first, so they were failed voice triggers. The game's a buggy mess. So those are the voices of the dead that we were hearing. All Creepy. None, because they're too dead to screw anything. <laughs> Alberto's dead. <laughs> Don't be a fuzz kill, Aiden. <coughs> yeah. <laughs> I'm serious. He was killed taking down the windmill. How'd it happen? <clears throat> we put Vincenzo's plan into motion, but then... Alberto had to go in his son's place. Sacrificed himself to blow up the windmill. Fuck me. To Alberto! <coughs> to Alberto! So he's lying. He's saying Alberto did it. <laughs> Interesting that he's gonna get all the credit. He, you know, he didn't want it. He wanted his son to get it. He's <clears throat> outside. Look around. All right. Vincenzo. <laughs> we did it, Aiden. My dad. He really did. Your father wanted me to tell you, uh, he's always been proud of you. Very proud. What? Why are you telling me this and not him? Shh. Take he a died. guess. Vincenzo died for the bazaar. Was he in pain when he died? No, he was all smiles. Lying. Because of you. And because he was able to carry out your plan. You. Thanks for being there with him, Aiden. Your dad kicked <laughs> ass, Vincenzo. Yeah. Battle Duck says, Mutton, fresh mutton. Chopped off PKs. Get your fresh mutton. Nice limbs and uh, arms and shit. Ew. Alberto's all right. Hell of a craftsman. For a loser, you mean. For a failure. That's what you used to say. If only we had more like Alberto, the PKs would have been gone ages ago. You go in and check on Vincenzo now. Subtitles are fucked again. Yep. He did a freaking awesome job, Aiden. We'll beat the PK and we'll help you get to the center. You're one of us now, brother. You're part of the bizarre family. Thanks, Barney. Good luck. Good luck, Pilgrim. Hey, Akon, where are you? I'm waiting for you at the girl's place. You'd better hurry, Aiden. The passage to the center, it's blocked. I have another idea. Just come quickly. Time is not on our side. Okay. I'm coming. Okay. Um, Mexican Andy to me $2 asking about the Cyberpunk update. I'm not playing the Cyberpunk update. I don't own Cyberpunk. I refunded it. Got my money back for it. I'm never spending another dollar on Cyberpunk ever again because ever again because the game sucks. So, no, I'm not playing update. I don't care how many times they fucking update Cyberpunk. It's still a piece of shit. <clears throat> okay.
Parkour. <laughs> Lots of the parkour. Running with parkour all of the time. It's gonna be great when we finally have fast travel, because this fucking sucks having to keep running across the rooftops constantly, you know. Not to say that it's it's horribly time consuming or annoying, but I would certainly prefer to be doing more meaningful stuff. So if that means fast travel to get around so I can focus on missions, then so be it. Zombies bursting out of windows. <laughs> no! Oh! Bandy Andy says I'm almost to the city, so I'm almost to the next part of the game. I'm getting there. Not yet. Okay. Here we are. So I want to climb this fucking mess. Uh, just jump and climb. Yep. Where is the door? Uh, over here. Yes, but it doesn't open. Do I break this? I guess maybe. You can't use weapons here. There's a door on the other side. I was on the other side. <laughs> it's gonna be annoying. Okay, great. It's already on the other side, but... You didn't get to the actual door. Fuck you. There. I was standing right next to it. Hack on. Uh, you're finally here. Let's go. When Yana heard you were coming, she grabbed Sarah and they left. Seems they weren't too fond of you. Hey, where are we at? Uh, oh shit! Arrow! Oh, Damn! Calm down, let me see. Let me see. I'll help. Ah, that sucks. Wait. I'll help. Show me. Arrow to the Come chest. Gonna pull through. What's that? The wound from the Lazarus? You say you killed Lucas. He killed Lucas. Lucas would only took a few seconds to do the job. Oh shit. I thought he was a better fighter. Ah the fuck are you saying? No point denying it with this wound right. So you carved out his tattoo and planted it on Barney. Ah, Waltz. He ordered the kill. You're working with Waltz and you didn't tell me? Uh -huh. You piece of shit. Oh, you don't get it, kid. Waltz would have killed me, you see, like he killed Dylan. And anyone who defies him. I have to get out of here, get it? I couldn't have told you why you know he's the one who tortured me in the past i didn't tell you in order to protect you so what if you find out something about your sister waltz will kill you where is he oh, where is waltz supposed to meet him under the electric car factory in the gre tunnel hey then i'm fucking dead here understand they're gonna kill me you'd leave me you'd leave me now Oh, I guess we'll help him. I should leave you to die for what you did. Why wouldn't you? I'm gonna find that sniper first. Really? You do that for me? A life for a life. After that, we're fucking done. Well, why wouldn't they still be shooting arrows at you? Right? Why did they stop? <laughs> Is he that goddamn sniper? No, nothing. Use your binoculars. Shut up. I'm done listening to your sage advice. So we have to stop. Yeah, new story Let's quest. Deal with the that. sniper. Where is he? Oh, achievement. Those bolts fly far and fast. 
Okay. Find something to hide behind. Tell me something I don't already know, Hacker. I got a combat skill point, so I can upgrade. Wait a minute. I got one of each. Holy shit. I got a skill point, one of each. I can do double upgrades, so we're going to do that. Uh, Mexican Andy to me a $1.50. And says, did you say the new King of Fighter is tomorrow, Thursday, in addition to Friday Night Fights? Looking forward to some Terry Bogart and Iori. I'm playing King of Fighters 15 all day long tomorrow. Both streams. Okay? That's going to include offline and some online gameplay. I am not doing Friday Night Fights this week. <clears throat> Excuse me, because Friday is the release of Horizon Forbidden West, which I'm also doing all day long. And then there will not be Friday Night Fights next week, because that's the premiere of Elden Ring. But King of Fighters will be covered uh, in depth over the course of this coming week, so... So what the heck do I want to get? Let's see. Uh, precise aiming, which is... This would be good if I had a bow, which I don't have. Um, drop kick. Run an enemy. Hold right bumper to jump. Press the left bumper when in the air. You do a flying drop kick to an enemy. Look. Boom. <laughs> That's ridiculously silly. Ground pound. Windmill. Stab. Perfect. Uh, right now I have perfect dodge. You know, when attacking enemies, throws them aside. When an enemy moves towards you, press X and a direction. Left thumbstick. Successful grapple will stagger the enemy. So instead of perfect parry, you can grab them and toss them in a direction. Eventually, you could throw them. Look at that. So you can throw them off the buildings and shit. That would be pretty good for combat. Whenever they go to attack, you grab and toss. Oh, man. I'm either going to get that or drop kick. What do I want for parkour? Dash for as long as your stamina lasts. So unlimited dash. Enemy jump. Press right bumper when darting. You can jump off of an enemy. There's wall running. Increase your overall speed and mobility while sneaking. Get any advantage to perform crouch jump. Oh, I definitely need crouch jump. I have a little bit of history with that. <laughs> right? A crouch jump. Duck no, jump, then crouch. In this case, no. It's crouch, then press in left thumbstick. <clears throat> oh, my God. <laughs> drop kick is hilarious. So you just run, you jump, and then you do drop kick. I'm going to get it. I'm just going to drop kick people nonstop in the game for the rest of the game. <laughs> just run and drop kick everyone. Never use a weapon ever again. Um... Run through groups of enemies without losing any momentum and lowering the damage you receive. Press left bumper when you're moving forward. Look at that. You just push all the enemies out of your way. That sounds pretty good, right? Fuck it, I'm gonna get that. I'm gonna get. I'm gonna do that. Okay, run. While I'm running, press the left bumper. Just go, oh, 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 oh. Knock them all out of your way. All right, so now I gotta find the sniper fuck. Stamina. Nathan, you all right? <sighs> yep. What's fine. For all the chemical waste, I fuck that. I got eyes. I can't. I shot the sign. Nathan, he's sticking to the roof. Stop. What the fuck? What just blew up? I get across. Uh, oh, here we go. Zipline, do it. Zipline, I'm pressing right bumper. <laughs> I pressed it three times. Fucking didn't grab it. Idiot. Here we go. Here we go. Oh, you piece of shit. He just chat detached the ladder. Drop the ladder. Well, so much for surprise. We figured something out. Still in one piece. For now, yes. I gotta get behind you somehow. They're not really giving me a hint at how to do this. Like, uh, what do I do? They're not even showing me where he is. Where the fuck is he? There's no yellow. Look. There's no yellow 
objective marker. So I have no idea where I'm supposed to go to climb because it doesn't show me where the fuck he is. Now it appears. Now it's gone again. Why does he keep disappearing? <coughs> How's my immunity low when I'm standing on UV? Oh my god. I so I can't climb here. I don't know what to do. This is nothing. This is a dead end. I don't think I can climb here. Although I wish I could. Maybe I can. Okay. Uh, yeah, if I can find a way up, like this rope, perhaps. Ah, fucking William Tell. I can't do me like that. Who else wants to kill you, Hakon? Ader? The, uh, the PKs? I lost track ages ago. Oh. Uh. Okay, now climb up here, baby. I think this is correct. Seems like the right way. And now I jump over there. Can I make it? Maybe if I get a little bit of a running start. Ready? Okay, I made it nicely. Okay, good. Now, maybe I can just climb. Perhaps. Because I don't see... Yeah. I don't see another way to do it here. So maybe I just climb here. No. That's a no. Perhaps this, this thing here? This tower? You think I could climb? We can try. Okay. Promising. But now what? Uh, no, I have no stamina. Oh, okay, at least now I got a shortcut back up here. So that's good. Could I climb this tower at all? It doesn't look like it. Oh, here's some bees. So maybe there's another way up, right? Like this. Let's look. Or is it supposed to be the tower? But it doesn't look like I can climb that. Right? Try again. No, I can't go up at all. They won't let me? No. No. I don't get it. No, I, I don't know. It looks like they want you to go here, but you can't climb the tower. And then this, they don't let you scale this. Maybe there's another way. Do we go inside? No, it's blocked off. So that doesn't work. Uh, wow, this is nice and well designed, I can tell. They really put a lot of effort into this, huh? I can't do that. We're already here. Okay, hold on. Okay, okay. Oh my god, I gotta grab this fucking crate? Seriously? God damn. No, what, what happened? What the fuck? He literally fell for no fucking reason. At least there's a ladder over here now. But why did he fall? He's a fucking piece of shit, man. He had half stamina bar. He fell for no reason. They, they really think that the parkour is way more fluid than it is. They think that they, like, perfected this first-person parkour formula. They didn't. It's wonky. I have no clue why he fell. Okay. Thank you. Thank God that they put fucking trash bags there. I'd be pretty pissed. Okay. Ugh. <laughs> A frustrating game. Drop 
kick. Do the drop kick. What? What do you mean what? It's a woman. Big deal. Drop kick. Why are you protecting that asshole? Who sent you? Fucking Santa Claus. This has nothing to do with you. Why did he not? I don't understand. He's an idiot. You gotta pick your friends better. <laughs> Why are you hunting Hakon? Who's this about killing Lucas? Or... Tell Hakon that it's not over yet. Hey, 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 ah. Right. That's totally how parachutes work. <laughs> That's completely how they work. Yes. Hakon, you still alive? Uh, my meter's still running. Hakon, yeah, she got away. But you're safe. For now. She. There was a woman. Fuck. Yeah, and I don't think she likes you. That sounded personal. Personal, huh? It doesn't usually narrow it down. But I know who it is. Watch out for her, Eden. She's one of the most dangerous people you'll ever meet. And yeah, noted. Now I'm going to the central loop. Beware of wolves, Aiden. Renegades have appeared all over the center, and he's working with them. He's looking for the key you've got. I'm done listening to your advice. Sophie, I'm gonna need your help getting to the center. The guy who was supposed to get me there, he... Well, things got complicated. Aider's men are still fighting. They barricaded themselves inside the tunnel. I can't help you. What about our agreement? <sighs> Relax. Listen, there's another way through. An old tunnel under the hills near the Tango Motel. It was used by smugglers. Peacekeepers didn't even know about it. It's been closed for years. But if you manage to start the generators, you might be able to get to the center. Okay, there's gonna <laughs> be a major story mission. Just now. Sorry, Adam. I want to help you. But most of all, I have to help the bazaar. Good luck, Pilgrim. So the major story mission is to get to this Tango Hotel, turn on a bunch of generators, and then use that to get out of here. Look at that. It's at the very tail end of the map. Okay. <clears throat> Looks like you get a lot of experience points for doing it, too. Get the, to the Dynamo Car Factory. And I, I assume, if we indeed do actually do this, this probably will unlock the next portion of the game, which is all of this that we haven't been to go to yet. Because you haven't been available, right? It looks like we're all unlocked then. So. Alright. We're off. <laughs>